Well, suddenly it comes out the back and Taylor can jag one and can half a chance. No problem. Oh, it wasn't the prettiest game, probably for a spectator point of view. Um, yeah, there was a lot, of, a lot of stoppages, a lot of numbers around the ball. Uh, just the skill execution from our group uh, wasn't as clean as it we'd like it to be. And uh, we turned the footy over a little bit too much than what we'd like. Um, Richmond able to capitalise on that and uh, we weren't very efficient forward of centre. Yeah, absolutely, fantastic uh, from Jace. Also, our whole back line stood up. Jock Patford was very good. Dan McStain, his second game. Dizzy Gardner came back, so um, for young men and young key defenders, for them to stand up on the G on a big stage was, uh, was really important for our group and a good stepping stone in their development. Yeah, I spoke to them more pre-game. A lot of them hadn't experienced playing at the, the mecca of footy. Um, it was a great taste for them. Um, you know, it's, what, it's where you play the big games, where finals are played, and that's where you aspire to play uh, at the end of the year. So, yeah, as I said, great experience. Um, we're down there again in a couple of weeks, which will be uh, good for our group also. Yeah, a quality outfit, West Coast, have been for a number of years. Um, got some really good players. Uh, yeah, got beaten by Sydney on their home deck last week, so um, it's a big road trip for them. We certainly have got to be uh, bouncing back this week. Um, against a quality outfit. Yeah, the bloody thug. Uh, or we might have to get like a Dane Zorko um, or maybe Squishy Taylor to play a bit more midfield time this week. Got some guys in Nifu still in consistent form in Zach O'Brien. Uh, might look at Jack Crisp. So there's a couple of, uh, couple of guys in there to possibly get some opportunities. Yeah, we're certainly lacking a bit of experience in the midfield, but again, it just creates another opportunity for a, for a younger player. Yeah, Saturday night footy here at the Gabba. Um, hopefully it's uh, fine conditions and yeah, we can get a big crowd coming up, uh, supporting the group and getting us over the line.